Hey everyone and welcome to a, another vlogmas. Now I'm kind of coming from past time slash present time, I don't really know, but this vlog didn't really have an intro. So here's an intro for you all. I am still in Poland in this vlog, I am in Krynica, whatever it's called, and me and mum are basically rushing to go get a buffet because buffet breakfasts are the best thing of life. So enjoy the vlog and I will see you guys all tomorrow. We're so lost trying to find breakfast that the staff are trying to take us there because we have no clue. We found the restaurant. Yay. Here we have a Polish meat selection. Yeah. Oh, we've got some horseradish, mother. Oh. Omelette stand. No Not doubt mum, mum will be having one of those. Then we've got coffee machine. Oh, how many? One, mm -hmm. two, three, four, five coffee machines, just for small measures. I wonder if they've got oh. almond milk, black coffee, espresso. No, look, you like coffee. put the pump through. That's so weird. Ooh. There's like a thingy. Okay, I won't be having a thingy. Let's do it. I'll have a look at the other food first. Then we've got lemon water, normal water, orange juice, apple juice, fruit, yogurt, cake. Is that it? It's not as extensive as I thought. Well, that's deeply disappointing. It certainly is. It it's literally all I can have is meat and fruit. Are you joking? Yeah. yeah no, basic. where's the bread? No, there must be more. Where's mm -hmm. the bread? It's a whole other room. There's a whole other room, guys. We're good. We're good. Um, okay. Sausages Polish and frankfurters and, and what are those? Droppings. <laughs> Pancakes. Okay. Pancakes with cottage cheese. Oh no. Oh no. Oh That's yes, they are. Yeah, yeah. Do you reckon those will have milk in them? Yes. Yes. We'll check. Um, Jams. Jams. Little sandwiches with radishes. Not really sure. These are for children, I think. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is. Just... Oh, okay, okay, okay. I take back about breakfast not being that great. Then we've got warm bread rolls, different breads, mm -hmm. scrambled egg, which again will have milk in it. Oh, sausages with ham. <gasps> Or onions, oh. just look at those mm. onions. It's going to say, get closer to it. Bacon. Bacon. Oh, how beautifully arranged. More, More sausages. Oh, what is that? That is white sausages from the pan yep. with oak Pol smoke. Polish smoke. Baked beans. This is baked Oh, no, we don't want oh, any farting. Oh, I quite like baked beans. <laughs> Eggs Benedict, oh. mum's favourite. Mm. Cereals. And a... Per 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 Oh, pate, I love pate. Oh, and salad bar. Ugh. Yeah. 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 Salad bar. Mm. Okay. Okay. Okay, so Misha is still faffing around. Mm -hmm. So that's my starter. Um, that's my still starter. <laughs> because there's more to follow that we haven't picked up. These breads, some of them are wheat free, some of them are not. Then there are some more milk milk, meat even, with gherkin, and then some more bread, cucumbers are honestly, Polish cucumbers are just another world, they really are, and a Russian salad, oh, can't wait. Here's also another plate of food, so let's dig in, oh I need some water. So we just ate our body weight in breakfast, <laughs> quite literally, and, and we've come back to the room, oh my gosh it's cold outside, and um, all of the night we could hear kind of strange noise and I thought it was a jacuzzi but look up there we've got okay look at this view this is genuinely oh. what dreams are made of people yeah, Misha's famous saying oh there's a stream oh wait it's very slippy oh, okay. oh my gosh it's very slippy just look at it you know when Misha said Polish Alps this is just oh my gosh this is literally <laughs> like it looks like an Instagram filter but I swear it's not <laughs> and this oh, is look, look here you go we can have our morning coffees. How we cute. Ah, my bag is so wet. Oh my gosh, it's literally like an ice rink. <laughs> shimmy, shimmy, eh, shimmy, eh, shimmy, ah. Oh, that's gorgeous, me. Sort of check the lighting now. I think the sugar's gone to us. <laughs> Just, like you know, casually rushing around trying to get some Instagram pictures before it gets dark. Um, hello. Casual. Hello. hello from the taxi. Just look at my hat, girls, boys. <laughs> 
and everyone in between. Misha's forced me to wear this. I've styled mom today and her outfit she has. looks banging. We shall get some outfits of the day later. I think I've got a bit of food stuck in my teeth. But we're currently in a taxi on the way to an amazing shopping centre. We were apparently having a relaxing spa day, no makeup, <laughs> chill. And then someone said that was a really good shopping centre and we were like, well, we're only in Poland. No, we want to get a flavour for the for the for the local um, traditions and we believe that shopping is one of them. Yeah. So Pretty we were much. forced. Yeah. But no. we do look at architecture as well and we will go definitely to some kind of museum, museum of fashion. But it's so beautiful here, like genuinely. It is it's just, like just a dreamland. Like, it that, is. Oh my gosh. You know Forget in, the Alps, Zakopane, that's the place you need to go so to. So you know in Elf where like at the beginning I think it is he's like running around in the in the winterland, it literally looks yeah, exactly like that. So yeah. This is insane. And the service here is just impeccable. You go, the service. And a nice, handsome Polish young taxi driver as well. He was very insistent on the door for me, not for me, Shaggy, obviously. Um, sees the beauty and all the woman. Excuse me. Careful, Jotty. Careful, she's going to run away with a Polish man. <laughs> Papa Grimes, you are fine, don't you worry. Oh, 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 we've gone very blurry. Obviously, the camera doesn't like us. Yeah, we're looking a little bit tired after last night. I so. see the beautiful. Okay, the lighting was like flattering, but she does look beautiful. <laughs> anyway, let's stop talking. Misha, why are you eating her? <laughs> We've eaten a big breakfast, you really don't need to. I actually don't feel that, that like crazy full. Okay, so what did we have? How many courses did we have? Yeah, it's a shouting match. I think we had about 10 loaves of bread, had about five sausages, had loads of fried onions. Sad times when half the ingredients at the table though were yep. like dairy, so and, we couldn't have them. And I had three eggs about three days ago and I swore that I'm never gonna have any more eggs. You can probably wonder why. And I probably had another three or four today, so. Whoops. Mm. Live whoops. a little. Whoops, I really whoops. I think it's gonna be a boom. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna stop recording now because we don't wanna hear about mom's <laughs> In Poland, we have a lot of speciality teas. I feel like we showed the last ones, we and did. these ones, I've still got the um, same kind of thing. So I've got cloves, I've got orange, I've got orange peel, what else? Oh, cinnamon stick. Yeah. And then mine's like a fruity concoction, there's even raspberry jam in it and orange slices. How cute! Oh. We made it back to the hotel, almost, <laughs> nearly. Mum nearly um, made us not pay slash pay because it was a nightmare, basically. Oh. She thought she had more Zlotti than she did, so we ended up paying part of it in Euro, but we're here, so it's fine. And we're not having dinner just yet, but doesn't mean we're not thinking about it, and doesn't mean we're not going to the buffet to eye up the options that's so we know what we're having do. later. Because, you know, all we think about it's food. Oh. That's not right. No. That's a door to the outside. Yeah. Uh, I think we need to continue. This way, this way, this way. Yeah. Mum's like a little lost puppy in this hotel and I'm just like leading her around. Yeah, I shouldn't but, be because I'm the only one that can read Polish signs. Oh, it is, it it is a nightmare because I'm normally the one in charge of all the travel, of all the trains, of yep. all the buses, yep. of all the ordering. I'm on my way out. She's on her way out. She, so she pretends <laughs> that she's doing it so I learn. And in actual fact, she's just lazy and can't bother to do it herself. Yep. So this holiday, she's had to do it. <laughs> and she's like, wait, what am I doing? And then she'll start speaking to me in Polish and I'll be like, Come again? <laughs> like, me Just no, the back time you learned no some speak Polish. Polish. You should have taught me when I was a baby. So I, should have. I was a career woman. I went back to work after three weeks of giving birth to her. Can you believe it? And they said that if who you leaves, abandoned who your leaves children, me at three weeks. Yeah, they say if you abandoned your children at a very very young age, especially in the first year, you're not gonna have a bond. I think they were lying. <laughs> anyway, let's go eye up the buffet options. Let's recognize this setting from earlier. We are back. Should we sit on a different table when we come back oh. tonight? You know, just to be adventurous. That's really dumb. Just looking at all the options, and then I open and the best thing on the sesame. planet. It's pierogi with yeah. bacon. With bacon, mum. That's my favourite way to have pierogi. Oh, let's hope there is no dairy in there. If there is, I, I still want to eat it, even though I, I can't. Sad. Are we ready for the most exciting news since sliced bread? Oh, I better bring my butter, actually. <laughs> so, yeah, I had to actually bring my own butter this morning because I didn't have any dairy free butter. But we're just changing sides. And all the hot food, apart from the soup, is all dairy free. They use potato based flour. I'm so excited. We're moving to Poland. <laughs> yeah, we are. They just need to get more almond milk in places and then I'm yeah, happy. And then we call. So, yeah, who's excited for Bigos for pierogi? Pierogi. Pierogi with pierogi. bacon. 
Misha, these are my chins that right does now. not look good. Come on, let's go. So we're gonna go get in some leggings. I'm gonna upload today's vlogmas. Yeah, just to explain, leggings is just so we've got extra expansions. Stretch. Stretch. Yeah, I'm in a dress right now, so I can't. Oh no, you can just stay as you are. And my legs are a bit warm. We can grow a belly. Got some nice Polish boys behind us. Hello, yes, I'm talking to a camera. It's probably not. Is there any Polish YouTubers? I don't know. I feel like I, I might Google it. Popular. I want to Google to see if there's any Polish vloggers. Yeah, if anyone knows, let us know. Yeah, maybe I'll start watching below. their channels. Then again, yeah. I wouldn't understand anything they're saying because I'm able to translate, but. Yeah, it's amazing. So we've been in Poland. We've had so many po more Polish subscribers. So, any Polish people out there, please spread the news. News? Up. About Misha Crimes. I don't think I'm new. <laughs> anyway, let's shut up because we're just talking rubbish now. Bye. So, yesterday we yeah. were in such a rush, and this morning we were in such a rush. This is what the room now looks like. Do you remember it being all beautiful with the rose petals? This now it looks like so a tramp's like quarter. No, it looks like someone's broken into our room. I mean, yeah. literally, this is. And just it's embarrassing because they haven't. Embarrassing. Also, yeah. we never got to explain about last night. I realised this today. I was like, Mum, did we ever say? what happened yesterday so you probably sick of seeing my face by now come on mum you're part of the story oh sorry sit down for story time so yesterday we were obviously at the miss supranational your hair why are you putting earplugs in I just so they're not to listen to you <laughs> <laughs> no not really <laughs> so yes, we're anyway, the, the reason why we have these little babies is because I've been rather congested, oh, yeah. and she Misha, as she's been if posting me, on Instagram. If you have me on Snapchat, you'll see half three Snapchat stories. Like, mum, <gasps> please stop like, snoring. <laughs> I also got a very funny picture of her, but it's a bit too um, raunchy to go on to. Can you not make me ear my, eat my ear <laughs> I think Misha should have them um, up her nostrils. But yeah, so pay. what I was trying to talk about, Mother, was Miss Supranational. So, no, but that's a better angle. Our faces look skinnier. Well, just don't get your chin in. <laughs> So and also, mum, this camera does weigh quite a bit. Trying to hold it whilst we speak takes some, takes some strength. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, back to what we're talking about. Yesterday with the Miss Supranational pageant. So we were obviously there supporting Rachel, who came in the top twenty-five. She was Yay! amazing. Korea won. Colombia came second. Rom uh, Romania. Romania came, came fourth. third. 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 Did she? Um, then Ethiopia came fourth, and then Puerto Rico came yep, fifth. fifth. Yep, yeah, that's great. That was the placements. Anyway, and we obviously were going to their support, Rachel. I emailed her to book tickets a couple of months ago, and we were just told to bring euros on the day. And the expensive tickets, the VIP, were 120 euros each mm. and then the normal standard tickets were 40 euros each so obviously we were like well we're gonna go for the standard ones like i'm not spending yeah. 240 euros nope. on some seats we love you rachel but you're not worth it sorry. no exactly and those seats didn't even include food like we were Nothing. like oh maybe there'll be a bottle meal. of water but um to no have, vodka inside no exactly i mean what's poland without vodka vodka <laughs> however you say it vodka but anyway so we arrived especially cherry flavored ones <laughs> Yeah, they're the best. Dressed up to the nines, and then we went to the normal bit. They were like, no, no, you're in VIP. We were like, we don't even have our tickets. We haven't bought them. Yeah, like, everyone was wearing trainers, and... Uh, no, they were genuinely in, like, you know, like, snow gear, because yeah. obviously they're Polish. They're used to this weather. They go out in, like, full-on thermals. When and we, we were, were... I was literally in, like, a metal bra and a skirt, <laughs> and Mum was in... You were more covered up than I was. We did have fur coats on to arrive in. <clears throat> um... But yeah, they were like, no, you're in VIP. On, Walk around. Like, you need to go around the other way. We are like, okay, okay then. Okay, we'll do that. So then we arrived to the VIP bit, and then we're like, no, we haven't actually bought any tickets. Like, we, d we don't have tickets. But we had tickets reserved by our friend Rachel. So about 20 minutes, they were looking for those tickets. Eventually, they found them. And they and were the then, normal person tickets. And they were the normal person And tickets. at this point... For which I'd... we haven't paid yet, by the way. Yeah. <gasps> so then at this point, I take our coats upstairs, because they're taking so long. So we're now there in our half-dressed attire, and we're standing by the entrance. The show is about to begin. And they're like, oh, the security lady is like, oh, yeah, we found a ticket. You need to go round, back outside and round the other way, round the auditorium. It's snowing. We were like, um, And there was ice. And we've got... 
Um, seven inch stilettos on. Maybe not. And no gloves And on. then this gentleman comes over who I actually recognise from the Miss Supranational um, organisation organization website. Mm-hmm. He's like, no, come through. You're coming no. with me. Sit here. Mm-hmm. We were sat on our front table. No, no, no. Before we sat on the oh, front table. Oh, that was so they funny. They sat us next to... They sat to... me next to um, this really, really <laughs> handsome man who was competing in Mr. Supranational, which, which is, is happening tonight. tonight. But yeah. we just, we can't, we but can't But then he came again. over. Yeah, he yeah. came over. So, so we were no, sat no, like, no. at the back of the VIP bit and then he came over and moved to the front table Nisha was gutted he was so hot oh honestly. he was smexy they would have made a beautiful Do, pair don't know if I'd go for a pageant boy won't no, I no definitely I think one pageant person is enough yeah I, I, think what, I think I think one of any type of career is probably enough you and dad do work together and like yeah there is a few mm. arguments over that okay. <laughs> so yeah we basically managed to somehow get 240 euros worth of tickets yep. for free I reckon it's because they knew that it was mum's birthday and she's yeah. just so damn beautiful oh. That's really true, I didn't think of that. So, thank you, Supernational, for my beautiful birthday gift. Mm -hmm. Let's get ready for dinner. Bye. Food. 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 (laughs) I'm excited for Perigo. 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 I said Perigo and Beagles in one word. Mm -hmm. Perigo. So, we don't actually leave tomorrow. We go to a dance tomorrow to go and see my mum's Polish family. But we were just checking for the way back because the next plane we get tomorrow, we have 32 kilograms each because Polish airlines are very generous. But on the way back, we're going with Ryanair, just realised we have 20... Well, not so generous, as we we've just found out. 20 kilograms each. Mm. And on the way in, we had 23 kilograms each, and we were both at, like, 21, 22. Two borderline. And we've obviously bought stuff. Mm-hmm. And we now have, have a problem. six kilograms less. And probably 10 kilograms... More. Si- 10 kilograms more yeah, worth we're going to have to Stay get another piece of luggage. Let's, let's play it by ear at the moment. Tomorrow, when we go to the thing we'll see how much our suitcases mm. weigh and obviously we can then put more stuff in our hand luggage excuse me how is this my fault you were in charge how is this my fault that She's ryan ed don't give you as much luggage like that's such a joke silly woman i feel like majority of this vlog is just me and mum walking in <laughs> corridors but we're back <laughs> off we've been exercise we've got today yeah that exactly actually. it's fine though i've got a high neck so it covers the chins <laughs> but we are now off to dinner Mum was like, let's go early. Let's go at six. It's like quarter past seven. Shock. We started packing. packing. I was editing. I'm time. trying to upload my vlog. Hopefully my vlog will have uploaded and you guys will have seen Vlogmas Day 2, part one of Poland. I hope you enjoyed. And yeah, I'm really out of breath. And I don't know why, because we've barely done any exercise right it's now. It's called too much eating and not enough exercising. Yeah, <laughs> I need to get me in the gym. Roll on January, everyone. Life of a YouTuber when you're at dinner and you have to bring your Mac along so that you can upload your vlog because it's going to be half an hour late at this point. And she doesn't mean McDonald's, just in case you don't realise that. What, the restaurant? Mac. Donald's. Oh, OK. And she's a bit slow on the uptake. We're both rocking different, very different styles of ponytails right now. Yeah, Mum is a nest, Cooper's nest, and Misha's Mom, like, is a... I'm like Dumbo is. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Right, see you later. I'm going to choose some food though, I'm so excited. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to come, I'm going to come. Oh, do you want to get some water for us, Mum? They've got lemon water. <laughs> She's my little slave, joking. We're each other's slaves. Okay. Nisha, just upload your video. What are you doing? So that's my starter. We've got a variety of hams, uh, pickled mushrooms, peppers, olives and some Polish salads, one with tuna. Yeah. And now over to Nisha's. I basically got the exact same. Exact same. Just, yeah, the exact same. Just more. Mm-hmm. I'd say mine is not more. I've got less meat. Let's eat. And now for the main course. We've got some carrots. We've got bigos, which is like a sauerkraut with various bits like mushrooms and meat. Um, then we've got um, potatoes with the rosemary and then various bits of meat that I can't really explain. This is like a potato dumpling kind of thing with some bacon. And these are um, potato pancakey things. And here's my plate of mush, but good tasting. So because we're so greedy, um, we are now having another extra two. And look at Misha. <laughs> She's gone for seconds. Oh my god. Okay, so you need to try this bread. You need to try this bread. Me. Okay, so you need to try this big. bread. So, death by carbs, here we come. So, I'm pretty sure everyone in this restaurant thinks I'm really strange because they keep giving me weird looks as they speak to my camera, but you know, 
Um, I've never tried Beagles before. This is amazing. Try Beagles, people, and potato cakes. I feel like my reasoning is that, you know, you need to line it yourself for winter because we don't want to freeze to death. So we're just fattening up. Um, just to demonstrate what good eating habits I have, look at the tablecloth around me, okay? I've got a little bit of oh, bread right there. And then look when Misha... I was giving mum my potatoes. No. What a okay. mess giving mum my is. Giving mum my bread, giving mum my potatoes. So I should sleep. I bet you've got some food stuck in there as well. Yes, you do. Grimes girls never ever leave their food. Why are you doing it food. so close up, mum? <laughs> Why are you doing it so close up? Excuse I me. did better than I'm you. I'm a famous YouTuber, just in case you did not know. You are, aren't you? You can now have pudding, because there's nothing for me to eat. No, I don't think I want a pudding. I want some melon, maybe. Yeah, I'm sure they have some lovely, healthy fruit, Alicia. I don't know if you've ever heard of table etiquette, so Mama Grimes just treated herself to some pudding. I'm not sure about it, but let's wait and see. But she forgot her spoon, so what did Misha do? Misha took a spoon out of, of a sugar. sugar bowl and gave that to me. That's just completely unacceptable. And if you were it's dining with the child. Queen, what would she do? She'd ask you to leave. Well, I wouldn't use my fingers if I was dining with the Queen. <laughs> you would do what? Oh, I wouldn't use my fingers. And her toes, if she could. I really want you that know? jam that we had earlier. That was such mm. good jam. Okay, so Mama Grimes is going to finish the grapefruit, but sadly not the cakes. Um, that's just one thing that I do not think Polish got it. Do you agree, Misha? I can't eat them anyway. The, what we do like is pancakes, pancakes and, and lodi. lodi. I can't eat the lodi. And lodi. Oh, I nah, the pancakes, apple pancakes. Oh my gosh, they've got some. I just remembered. I've oh, got yeah. some over there, but you can have them because you can't have dairy. Sorry. Back to your grapefruit, Misha. Oh, look how much is your top. I didn't like the grapefruit. I've got melon really in my teeth. Cool. Mm. I jam? don't even want to know that. Should we check if there's any jam over there as well? Jam. Okay, Misha's going to have a bread with jam for pudding. I don't mean there will be any jam. Sad time. Mum seems to think she's a famous Misha, YouTuber. Yeah, Misha's decided that um, it's just about time that she did some exercise. So I said, I'm going to go and find some pancakes. I said, she I'd come said for the walk. Me, she's gonna come for the walk. Okay, we're in this restaurant, and that that kind of walk through um, room over there. That's is at where least the, two calories. Where, where the pancakes are. I think you're dreaming, Misha. That's probably you. you My probably... vlog is alive. Go and watch Vlogmas Day Two. It took about an hour to upload. Oh, and you committed. Let's go. Okay, so this is the pancake in its original state, but I'm going to um, perform some surgery on it and remove the the cheese which i'm not too keen on so let's see what i'll end up with okay so the operation has been performed and i think we'll all agree that what we saw before was misha and what we can see now is um kasha at 56 years later <laughs> isn't it a stage but never mind we'll eat it and this is what misha got so no, she's got some not bread not necessarily eating it unless they have jam okay so she's going to have one two three four slices I'm of bread with much. jam I first of all cut one and then it was dry. <laughs> dry. I'm actually not eating all of it. Okay. So, um, I've just got some of this bread. We've just asked about the jam situation. I just needed to show you guys how, like, sexual this bread is. Like, it's just sexual. Okay, I say she sexual. hasn't got a boyfriend, not so like she's now sexual having a, a relationship with bread. Oh, I'm so very worried. worried. Look at, like, just... Oh. <laughs> she looks so odd. <laughs> Look at the sponge, you know. So, <laughs> Mum's just gone and got herself not only one, but two pancakes. Yep. I had to make up for Misha's bread. And I'm going to perform another plastic surgery on it. <laughs> you seem like a surgeon in all of my videos. Like, can they hurry up with my jam, please? <laughs> I'm waiting. Okay, she'll, she'll demonstrate. Oh, okay. Okay. Let's watch Mum in action. Let's watch Mum in action. Wait, 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 it's blurry, it's blurry, it's blurry, it's blurry. Wait, stop, stop, it's blurry. Here we go, go. So I'm removing all the fat. It's a bit like having a liposuction, but it's on a pancake. <laughs> so, sorry. Mum's got not, like grapefruit not, around her <laughs> mouth and cream cheese. But I'm not a fan of lots and lots of cream. Um, so I've just performed this little keyhole surgery. Well, <laughs> There it is! As good as you! I feel like this pancake is the definition of they go into the surgery Class. room. No, no, they yeah. go into the surgery room, they're like, I want to look like this pancake, and then that's what they end up looking like. <laughs> <laughs> that's what mum looks like, doesn't she? Because mum has so much plastic <gasps> surgery that her face doesn't move. I am right. joking. 
A little bit of Botox does not hurt a 56-year-old girl, does it? See, also, she's such a fake that her, her fat is falling out. <laughs> but look, my jams are ripe and they brought me two options. I love them. Let's eat my bread. I'm so excited. How nice would it be with the cream cheese? And mm, the... That cream cheese is very, very nice. But... Eat it. Eat it. No, eat it's it, too sweet. Eat. We are lost. Seven, 20, oh, we needed to go up, not down. Shock, we're in the corridors again because we're lost and I'm okay. genuinely we, so bloated. We I look six know, months no, no, pregnant. No, no, secret. Show me, show. I'm, I'm expecting <laughs> twins. Like, not even just one child. Twin. Can you see? Can you okay, see? so for those who watch Misha's Limes video... I, I, oh, don't, because it actually really hurts. <laughs> this is why I don't eat bread and I don't eat potatoes, because this is what they do to me. Yep. So, unfortunately... And then tomorrow you're going to see footage of me eating bread <laughs> and eating potatoes, but I kind of can't not when I'm here. So it yeah. is difficult. But yeah, as you may know, Misha's got the justice issues because of her limes, and that's how it shows it. So, there is always a price to pay for eating extra bread. Oh my gosh, like genuinely. Oh my gosh, I feel like my waters have okay. broken. <laughs> I think, I think we, might I have think to we stop need to call 999. Someone Can is giving take birth. A nap? Can I take a nap here? <laughs> also, we were just walking out and. <laughs> no, we are honest, law abiding citizens. Not like our story earlier when we had the 120 euro tickets for no money. Um, so yeah, we, we were just. We were invited. Yeah, true. Mm -hmm. So we were just leaving dinner and then mum goes to them as we were walking out. Oh, do we pay here or do we pay at reception? So it's like a buffet as part of the hotel. And then basically, it turns out if we hadn't have said anything, then we would have had a free dinner. But because they would have assumed we were on dinner, bed and breakfast when we booked through bookings.com, we were on dinner and breakfast. But you know, you've seen what we've eaten, and that was £38. I yeah, think that was a so bargain. I think we still got a bargain. Yeah, and we're just expecting, so that's oh a, my gosh. A, a, a double benefit. No, because children are expensive. <laughs> that's true. Yeah, but Misha, you do a big fart and they'll go. <laughs> no, I wish it would, but it won't. It's probably going to take me about two weeks to nurse down. <laughs> Welcome to the real life. Life of Misha Grimes. Yeah. Her, her actual stomach is bigger than her boobs. <laughs> That's because I have no boobs. Um. too far. <laughs> We're in room 318 and these go to 500. Okay, explain. Okay, I thought we'd walk through too many tunnels, <laughs> so we would just walk. Have you actually peed yourself? <laughs> Come on. Okay. 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 So when okay. Mama Grimes eats too much crab, um, she gets uncontrolled fluctuations. So I let about 20 out and then I looked behind and there were some people there. No, it was a waitress. She said, good evening. No, 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 no Mum. You would have, your, your fart was so loud. I think the camera probably heard it. Okay, right now I'm going to play back the clip where Mum fought and it comes I, up on the camera. I don't fart. Sorry, she perspires. I exude her. So she... Um... <laughs> we were stood like literally in this spot we are right now. <laughs> and about like, is that 100 yards where she was? Oh, I don't know what's the yards. It's about... Two metres. About <laughs> two metres. Like, Mum does a massive fart, and I was like, ew. And then this woman, this waitress, literally walks straight past. 
first. And earlier when we were getting into the taxi, Mum did the exact same thing. Yeah, but at least I was polite and I stood outside waving it away. <laughs> we finally oh. found ourselves on the right floor. And this footage is four minutes long. No, but right genuinely, forward, I think I lost half the calories that I <laughs> ate from laughing because my abs oh. hurt from laughing so I much. I haven't got any abs. But Mum, you might want to change your leggings for some more. I might have to wash them now. If anyone's got a spare nappy, please send them Mama Grimes away. <laughs> We're now going to go in and watch the Mr. Supranational pageant that we could have gone to this evening, but that would have been way too much effort. We would have preferred to eat food. <laughs> so we get lucky two nights on the trot and get no. the IV. I'll, I'll watch the boys from home. I don't need to see them in person. So, yeah. You know Mum's birthday's coming to an end when we're having to take down her sign. How sad. Oh, I don't want to rip it, but we're going to take it with us and keep it for next year because she only gets one round of decorations every 10 years. So we'll see you at 66. So I was just saying to Mum, we have this thing in my family where we say... It's obviously really premature, but it's what's the best thing that's happened in 20... 17, 2016, 2015. Well, it's December the 2nd, so we've still got a month. Yeah, you never but know what will happen. I just said to Mum, what do you think my best of 2017 is? So, do I write it down? Because how will we know? Well, obviously, you're not going to lie. Well, I know what's in my I head. Know, I, I know. Well, I'd say you starting YouTube. One of them. Uh, excuse me. This is like the Primark challenge. She says one outfit, one best thing, and then she says one of them. But... Is there another? What do you think the other one is? Okay. Think okay. proper. I will actually be doing like New Year videos, like best of 2017 and stuff like that, but let's see what Mum thinks the other best of 2017 thing is. Not going to the university. You still didn't get it. Oh, okay. Very true, very true, but I feel like that's interlinked with YouTube. I'm so surprised you haven't no, got it yet. Don't, don't, okay. Come on. Third time okay. lucky. No, no. Third time lucky. Come on, Mama, I believe in you. Okay, so what she should be saying is the fact, as you all know, Misha has Lyme's disease. However, we have, set, have had some good news, which is that her Lyme's is now dormant, be it she's still fighting with the side effects. Another good shout, but Another it wasn't actually what shout. I thought. Okay, and now I've forgotten what the other one was. Winning Galaxy! Oh my gosh, that's enough! Oh my gosh, 2017 has been such a good year! That's, that's, that's not the one either! That's not the one! Oh, okay, turn me off again! Oh my gosh, oh. I didn't realise what an insane year I've had! <gasps> oh. My best 2017 video is going to be insane! Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh! Okay, so much off. has happened this year. My eyes look really blue in this light. I have brown eyes. That's so strange. Contact. So she's giggling to herself. So I'm worried what the fourth or fifth guess, I'm not even sure what it will be. Wait, wait till it focuses on your face though, because otherwise we might miss it. It's not, but Mama Grimes is becoming a YouTuber! <laughs> <laughs> no. no. <laughs> um, if I give you one clue, okay. it will completely give you away, so I don't want to give you one clue. What does it relate to? Does relate to pageants, to be fair. Meeting Chloe! Oh yeah! my god! How could I? That's just so stupid. Best thing of 2017 <laughs> is meeting my best friend. Yeah. Whoop, whoop. That took you so how long. How could I? How could? How did I? Chloe, I'm going to tell you to watch this video because there's a secret surprise waiting. Mm -hmm. There's a surprise. The best thing that happened to me in 2017. <gasps> better than, well, not better than YouTube, but different to YouTube. YouTube. Different to Galaxy. Mm. Love you. Okay, Why do my eyes look now. blue? So, I was just planning out some December videos with my nice lace because I've got yeah, <laughs> because I've got my retainer in and I've realised that I need to end this vlog and I would show mum right now but um she's currently butt naked with her butt hanging out of the <laughs> bed sheet me. because that's Don't just share family secret <laughs> mum it's like 1am I say it's like 1am it's 12am same difference but anyway we are off to bed well 
let's see if I get to sleep. Um, and tomorrow we are off to Gdansk to go yeah. see Gdynia, Mum. Gdynia, Gdynia. We landing in Gdansk and your grandpa lives in Gdynia. Are we lives in Gdynia, not Gdansk? No, no, yeah. I thought you lived in Gdansk. It's only half an hour apart. Oh, okay. So we're going to Gdansk, but we're going to Gdynia yeah. to go and see my mum's dad and all of her family. So, yeah. I'll see what vlogness mess we're going to get from that. But I'm not making any promises, but I'm sure there'll still be lots of Christmas videos. So stay tuned. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you didn't laugh too much at us, because I mean, I don't think I've ever laughed so much in my life. My camera battery is flashing at me. I need to shut up. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. Let me know what, hmm, what should be the question of the night? What is the best thing of your 2017? so far because you never know it could surprise us in this next month and something incredible could happen let's hope also i have a very exciting announcement coming soon which i cannot wait to share with you all and i'm pretty sure that will go on the, le on the list of some pretty cool damn things that have happened in 2017 so yes lots of exciting things coming up i hope you enjoyed this video please give it a like and subscribe to my channel and me and the naked butt farty lady <laughs> shall see you all tomorrow. Bye. Bye.